do have some new information this morning about a near miss at the airport in Newark, New Jersey. A jet taking off got way too close to one coming in for a landing. And ABC's David Curley has the latest now on how this happened. Good morning. This really is an aviation nightmare. Planes are just not supposed to get this close to each other as they did at Newark. Newark air traffic controllers gave a United Airlines 737 from San Francisco with 161 on board permission to land. Another dispatch just seconds later to another aircraft. 4100 runway 4 right. Clear to take off. It's a United Express jet with 53 on board cleared to take off to the north on an intersecting runway. The air traffic controller realizes the two jets are getting too close and tells the landing United jet to immediately veer off. Seconds later, the warning to the express jet just lifting off. 4100 traffic off your right. Do you have any side same thing usual? Okay, yeah, we're putting the nose down. And, uh, yeah, he's real close. There's no way you should have another airplane close to you at a major airport. Your first response is disbelief, and then instantaneously you go take whatever action is necessary. The express jet dipping its nose down so it can dip below the bigger United aircraft. It was all over in seconds. Okay, yeah, we saw him, and uh, we're resuming the steady AC 4100. AC 4100, contact departure. All right, departure, yeah, he was real close, sir. The concern in that pilot's voice, because preliminary reports from sources suggest these two aircraft may have been within just 500 feet of each other. There is some good news. According to the FAA, while the number of flights is increasing, the rate of these incidents is actually declining.